have a sickness and I'm completely aware of it, but I will not seek treatment because it gives me like one little split second of, ah, yes. And that's, I like that. So I'm not gonna rob myself of like one ounce of happiness in my life. You know what I mean? So if you watched last week's video, you should already know what this is. I know, don't be mad at me. I had to do it. I'm gonna save my money because I have a spending pr problem. So I think I don't need fucking socks. All right, like I'm good. I don't need socks. I'm such a hypocrite. It's okay. <laughs> you know what? I was like, you know what? Exactly. Yeah. Ow! That was really close. I almost cut my like literal cuticle. As if I don't like peel off my cuticles every single day. Ooh, pretty. So in last week's video, I literally said they won't fit me because they're a woman's like, it goes up to like a woman's eight. And that is like a men's, no, a woman's 10, which is like a men's eight. But me being me and me being impulsive and annoying, I said, wait, it sucks. Like they'll stretch, right? I hope so. I will not be showing my feet because ew. Oh, sleep shorts. Cute, cute, cuticle particle. I hope these don't make me sweat. This is the most like, <laughs> this is the most for socks. These are the everyday socks. I'm gonna open one of them and just see what's going on. Please fit, please fit. This is what they look like. They're like completely white and they have the skims on the bottom. Oh my God, they fit. Enough of that. But last but not least, these are the slouch socks and these are what I'm most excited for because they're like so cute and like baggy. How fucking cute are these? Uh, I'm gonna die. These are so cute. They're very soft. Wait, I'm so happy. <laughs> they fit. I changed my coffee recipe a little bit and I now use simple syrup instead of, um, I used to use this. I used to use the stevia in the raw and it's like a zero calorie, like all natural sweetener, which is like, yes, like absolutely love that, right? But is it natural? Probably not. I'm probably better off with just real sugar. And sometimes when I would drink the coffee, it would give it a taste of, mm, you know, shit. So it was just not good. It's one cup water and one cup granulated sugar. Bring it to a boil on a pan and then just let it all mix together. Put it in a little jar, let it cool off and then put it in the fridge. Amazing, delicious, and it tastes good. disgusting it's really gross it's extremely dirty i'm aware it looks like i've been living here for literally a year but i i literally moved back a month ago and i've cleaned it since so this is probably actually just like a week of living and that's really really fucking sad and just disgusting on my part <laughs> i was gonna blame it on me like being depressed but like i'm actually fine as of right now uh, yeah, let me do that and stop procrastinating. I can't get over these boxes. Like, come on. Oh my god, okay, thumbnail. Wait. <laughs> god, I fucking hate my life. All right.
damn it. <laughs> Fucking shit. All right. Got a nice candle going on. Everything's clean. Everything's great. I have a three hour class at six. It is now 5.20. Oh fuck, it's so soon. Kill me challenge. I'm gonna win. Tomorrow I think I'm gonna get a haircut cause it's starting to look like a mop. Um. Shower, don't worry. <laughs> okay, I went to Bath and Body Works, and uh, here, here's a little haul. No, I'm filming, idiot. <laughs> Champagne toast. This is the one that makes my d It's so good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Yeah. Champagne toast. This is phenom.com forward slash. Yes. This is apple weather. I love apple candles in the fall. Like, Mm, it's so fresh and crisp and like delicious and delectable and synonyms. And last but not least, we got stress relief, eucalyptus and spearmint because um I need it. Mm. Mm. And they were all $10 off, so I saved like literally 30 bucks, which is like Cray Benet, John Benet Ramsey. And then I threw in this little winter candy apple hand sanitizer because you know what? Why why not? Oh wait, I know why. Because I can't stop spending money. Mmm. Yum. So today I'm going to a pop-up store for this brand called Mad Happy. I don't know if you guys are aware, but they make like really high quality like sweatshirts and shit. So I want to check it out and you guessed it, spend more money. Eh. This will be my last activity because I, I need to chill. I need to chill. This is what I'm wearing. Hoodie is from Ami or Amy, Ame. Um, Amy, Ami, Ami. This brand, and these pants are wide leg corduroy brown pants from Urban, and these Converse are from C Converse. Okay, it's Saturday now. I've been filming for three days. I'm so good. As if I didn't have like a three month like absence. Okay, let's continue. So, 
need to literally be checked into a hospital because I can't stop spending money. I'm like, I'm actually in shock that I bought this sweatshirt. I feel like I impulse purchase because of the quick like serotonin release it gives me, but then the novelty like immediately wears off and I'm already looking for the next thing that will give me like that. I don't know why I'm like that and I have to work on that. I really do because like, cause when I'm bored, I spend money and that is not good. At least it's cute, kind of. New York, I need to figure it out. I really need to figure it out. Does anyone else do that? Like, do they have like a spending problem only because it gives them that like, yay but then it wears off immediately and then you're bored and then you already are looking for the next thing. Let me know down below, like actually let me know cause like it will comfort me to know that there are other people like me. I got some Chick-fil-A, I know. I'm homophobic too, so it's, it works. <laughs> Thank you for coming on this journey with me of uh, spending money for no reason. I tend to do that a lot, but I am going to stop doing that because it's awful for my mental health and also bad for my bank account. So I think I'm gonna have to try to find things that bring me joy that that, that isn't shopping. Ew, that sounds so like, that puts a bad taste in my mouth, but I don't know. I gotta figure something out because this ain't it. Even though it's cute, I actually do like it. But anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I love you all so much. I hope it was entertaining. Um, I'll see you guys next week or the week after that. Who knows? Who knows what me? Who knows? I'm so crazy. Um, but yeah, follow me on Instagram, follow me on TikTok, listen to my new song, Ducky. And yeah. Bye.